What's going on guys? I'm the White Guy. We've got something a little bit different today. This is called Sled Simulator. It's, um, a, a, as far as I know, this is fairly experimental right now. And, um, it's a, it's a snowmobile simulator that one guy is building himself. And, um, it's kind of, it's a two-stick game. You can lean left and right and you can steer the snowmobile, but uh, as you're probably about to see, it's still, it's very, very early in development and there's a singular guy making it, so th things are subject to change. It might not be ideal. But, um, as far as snowmobiling goes, this is probably your best bet for a snowmobiling game. Just, again, keep, keep in mind, this is one guy is making this by himself in his spare time right now. And it's, um, very, very early, very, very early, like, alpha stage of the game right now. Where it's just experimental. This is on, I'm playing on PC and that's the only place you can get this. It's free to download right now. It's just that there's literally one guy making this in his spare time, so you kind of got to keep that in mind that there's, it's going to be very glitchy and very buggy because it's very early in the development stage. And right now this is the only map for it, but again, very, very early in the development stage, but you can still do some stuff like at 43 miles an hour you can huck a backflip almost. There we go, yep, there we go. Backflipped up the hill, nicely done. Can we try and side hill a little bit maybe? Um... Sure, we can do like the thing where you pull a ski off, and that's the edge of the map. So let's hop back down, see how fast we can actually get this thing going. I, I'm, I know the camera angle's off to the side, I'm sure people are going to complain about that. But uh, I can't figure out how to move the camera. Personally, I want the camera to be directly behind the snowmobile, but I can't figure out how to move the camera for the life of me. I, I've tried all the buttons, I, nothing seems to do anything for that. I know the basic controls for this. And that's what I have to go off of. You can try and send this off again, 100 mile an hour, it's just, you can maybe huck a double backflip even. Uno, dos! Yes, there we go, double backflip up the hill. And let's try not to start glitching through the ground anymore, which, again, this is very early alpha, maybe you guys will enjoy this. I saw a comment that was saying I should play this. Um, cause I did a video on this a long time ago, and it's been quite a while since we updated that. And this is just where it is. He started rebuilding the game from scratch. There's a different snowmobile in here than there was in the old one. And it's um, very, very early in development, so things are going to be a little, little bit wonky. But we'll do our best. Uh, it's... I want to say we can jump that gap back there if we come in from this side. Uh, there might be a jump over here also, too, we can try and bounce off of. Backflip, we do a flare off of it maybe? Nope, we'll just land it upside down. Again, very early alpha, it's just very basic elements of the game that are done right now. It's been like five years since he started this. I, this, there, this very well could be the end of it, I don't know if he's... There, he posted an update on the, on the website a while ago about something else. It's been a slow month of development. But I think he is still working on this. I, just, I wouldn't expect this to be done anytime soon. Cause it's been like five years and it, it's still being worked on, because there's just one guy doing it as a hobby in his spare time. Alright, this personally I think if, if that one guy got some funding or, and somebody wanted to pick this up, I think this could be very neat, because there really isn't a snowmobile game like this out there at all, and I'd be willing to bet this would sell decently well if this actually got finished and done, like if there was like freestyle tracks and backcountry riding and snowcross tracks and that kind of thing. But there just really isn't a game out there for it. I feel like this would do extremely well, but it, it, it might. It, it, I hope somebody would have to help the guy out and like get, start giving him more money and pay him to do this full time or something. Because um, it's very, very buggy right now. It's, it's, the suspension's a little bit unstable at higher speeds, as you're seeing when I land some of the jumps here. And oh, yeah, it's also mildly difficult to see where you're even going at times with this. Uh, there's a first person camera, but not sure how great it is because apparently stuck looking off to the side. The camera's just a bit wonky in the game too. I don't really know if there's anything it can do about that at all. But we'll try our best to make... we'll do our best with what we've got to work with here. I want to say there's like a gully or something around the lake here we can try and jump. Uh, cut left, 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 left. Yep, there it is. Um, yeah, we're doing 720, that's in 1080, 900, 1440. 1440 to stick the snowmobile below the ground, is what we just did there. It's a very, very cool trick. Um, let's try and turn left. Let's see, is there anything back here at all? Um, possibly not, actually. Ah, uh, we're glitching! 
All right, let's cut. Let's let's just let's find something. Let's try and oh, watch the trees. Dodge the tree. Dodge the ah wonky physics. It's uh, it's a little bit difficult to keep anything under control in the game as it sits right now, as you may or may not be able to tell. Just occasionally, for reasons I don't understand, the thing just bounces off sideways and flips over, like that. But um, again, very, very early alpha developments. Hopefully, I, I saw some comments suggesting that they want to see the updated video on this to see what's changed. Um, I, I would suggest um, maybe this hopefully gets some word out and more people see this and start realizing that this is a thing. And if more people support it, there's a chance that maybe this, if the word gets out far enough, maybe a studio wants to pick this up or if he can start doing this full time, which would be neat. But um. That's going to require a decent amount of funding to get this made at any time soon, I think. To get it made correctly and finished any time soon, I should say. And we're slipping and sliding all over the place again. Alright, let's just, let's just try and follow the trail up there. If we can get this turned that way. Okay, let's just follow the trail. Follow the trail. Follow the trail. And uh, there's a speedometer in the bottom right there, too. So is this them? If this is going, it doesn't look like you're going that fast, but this, this you do get going pretty good in this based on the, the speedometer. And again, very wonky physics, but this is like 0.21 alpha or something like that. It's very, very basic just to show that this does exist. Is more or less what the point of this is, to my understanding. Uh, can we do a wheelie even? Yes, you can do you can do a wheelie or a track stand, whatever it's called. So I guess snowmobiles don't have wheels. Um, there we go. Uh, yeah, there we now we're carving around. See now we're doing like those flat turns that people like to do on snowmobiles. Now now we got it figured out. Yep, yeah, there. See we're we're doing flat stuff now. We're we're doing we're doing tricks. All right, let's do another track stand. Nope. Come on. You know you want to... I, I had it going good a minute ago, now I, I can't get the wheels back, the front end to come back up and stay there again. There we go. And hit the tree. Nice. No, oh no! Oh boy. Okay, we, we barrel rolled out of that one, thankfully. Okay, now, yeah, see, now I've got that pretty stable. Ish. Ah, uh, let's keep it going. Alright. Can we front flip off of this, maybe, I wonder? Um, yes, you can do front flips, too. Huh, did you look at that? All right, let's see if we can... Die. Oh, go left, go left. Oh, oh, no, oh, no, we hooked a, we hooked a bad thing. We're, we're going to barrel roll in a second here, I think. All right, well, no, maybe not. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're doing good, we're doing good. Let's just follow the power lines down. Don't hit them, don't hit the power... Oh, there's a wall. That's the edge of the map. Huh, that's good to know. Alright, well, if we hit this fast enough, can we actually like, jump over the top of the hill? Perhaps? Yes, we can! Send it! Oh, oh, uh, keep it under control, keep it on. Okay, okay, nope. Keep it there, oh, there we, we can really yank that back up there now. Ah, uh, get back on the, get back right side up, there we go. Can almost like standing back flip off of that even. All right. Oh, there's like steam and mist going on here now. That's neat. Uh, let's try. But yeah, sure. We can we do that little flat corner turn type deal on top of a mountainside now? I wonder on the hillside, rather. Uh, let's see. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. Let's see if we can like yank the wheel up, and yank the front end up, and like flat turn it back around down the hill. Nope, apparently not. And we're clipping through the ground, and we're stuck in the tree again. Um, let's get the point it up the hill. All right, let's try this again. Uh, that sort of was what I was going for. All right. Can we can we carve up the hill though? Uh, sort of. We just clipped ourselves into a tree again. Um, can we get out of this now is the question. I think we can sort of... No. No, oh, there we go.
I, see, I'm leaning to the left into the turn there, and it still tries to buck me off sideways, which I just don't understand. But, um, again, very experimental physics here. It's, this is all very, very early development phase, so there are going to be some bugs and problems with it. Can I do a track stand down the hill? Nope, but I probably can do one going up the hill, I would bet. Alright, so let's turn this around and see if we can do that all the way up the hill now. I'm starting to figure out the controls a little bit better now. There we go. Up, oh, sort of, maybe. I think there's like a there's definitely like a day and night cycle in this too, because it was definitely not nighttime when, this, when we started here. Which is kind of neat. And you can see the track clipping through the back of the snowmobile right there too, which again, very early development. Things are gonna be a little bit wonky as we've been seeing throughout this whole video. Um backflip. Yes, there we go. Stuck the backflip up the hill. Let's, uh, let's try and front flip up the hill one more time now. So, actually, how fast can you even get going in this? Let's just find that out first. Hundred and, I saw 110 there, I think. And uh, let's just uh, pretend that didn't happen. Alright, let's launch into this thing full speed now and see if we can huck a front flip. And lean back, punch it forward. Oh, double, triple front flip maybe even. Oh boy! Quadruple front flip up this. Quadruple front flip down the hill. That's, um, that's an interesting spot, but I, I guess I'll leave you guys with that really dope trick. Um, uh, th that might be the last Sled Simulator video for a while now, because there really isn't too much new here, other than he's rebuilding the game. If you guys want to see more updates on this game as things change, let me know, but that'll probably be the next video in this game. It's probably going to be a ways out still. Thanks for watching if you made it this far into the video. Hope you enjoyed some something, something different, a little Sled Simulator, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.